Hey y'all, what's up? My name is Tom Mizu. It's my channel, Mr. 14, and I'm back doing an all you sips video. And this time is something related to drink. We we're trapped and go wrong. Like when you do some sneaky stuff and it come back to bite you, that's your problem. Don't try to sue now when you got this thing happening. So let's get into it. Hey, what's up, y'all? So, yes, listen. Y'all know recently it's just buzz going around with something going on with a model and Drake. And like I said, all you see this video is not going to be a long one. It's going to be a quick conversation. And I want y'all to put your comments in the comment section. And let's chit-chat there. So, we know Drake had met up with a model. They had a little rendezvous. They had a little sexual encounter and all that stuff like that. And she described his size and all that. So I said, we ain't even doing all that. You gave us so much details, girl. You had sex with him and that's it. He had a kind of more they had sex. And, you know, he ejaculated. And after that, he took, uh, he went to the bathroom, went to the bathroom, and I guess threw out the condom, all that stuff. So recently, while all that stuff happening, she went to the bathroom us but no to him, I guess. He went to the bathroom, fished out the freaking condom, and then tried to insert the opening part in her, and when that happened, she got a burning sensation down there because something was burning her. So now she's trying to sue because he put something down there and got her private parts burning. But I was like, girl, first of all, this is what you do with traffic go wrong. Because at the end of the day, when you said when you told us the story, first of all, we didn't need to know the story. You could have kept that to yourself. You could have kept the story to yourself. We need to know this out there. But now you put it out there. I will say this: a lot of celebrities do these things, or they go to a stream to not to get these people pregnant. Because there are people out there who want to have a kid by a celebrity because they get access to money. Instead of going and getting a job, working for yourself, doing your own thing, but you want to have a quick, rich get up by having access to somebody with their money and their wealth. And Drake, you know, he's a rapper. He make good money, all that stuff like that. He's a good-looking guy. And we only know he got one kid. But I know he has sex with multiple other people. And I know for him to go to that extreme by putting hot sauce, because what he did, he put hot sauce in a condom to kill the sperm. So I guess he do that ex extreme because he know that people probably, or female, probably will try to get pregnant by him. And I will say, if people go to the extreme, they know this has happened before. So he tried to avoid having too many baby mamas. So what he did, he put a, he went to the bathroom, he put the condom in the thing, wrapped it up and threw in the garbage. But why, as you as a female, go, go in the bathroom, being dirty, go and fish up the condom from the trash can? That first of all, it's in the trash. So what's in the trash? Why are you fishing that thing out? Not, uh, you're doing that because you want to get pregnant, and it's not. It, it puts in perspective how other people got pregnant by that um, tactic, turkey based stuff, all the stuff. I was like, first of all, why are you go to the street and try to do a condom, put stick condom in there, and try to put yourself in there to get pregnant by it? I was like, what is going through people's minds when they do this type of stuff? It's like, yes, you want access to the money, but it's other ways to get money. Yeah, because you don't want to put them in hard work. You don't want to work to get the paycheck, the nine to five paycheck, or build your own business because too much money. You won't have assets, but not necessarily. Let's say if it did happen, what make you think that he probably will be there? He might be financially, if it, if anything, but other than that, it still it still will be more harder in the, of rest of the years when you're raising a child by yourself. Then you're going to have no support. You're going to be constantly, well, no, because at the end of the day, you put yourself in a situation. People don't think about the long-term goals. They think about that right now. And since that person think about, oh, they could get the rich money, they could get, you know, they could trap all the baby by fishing the condom and putting yourself in it to get pregnant. It's like, that's crazy to me. That is crazy to me. And that's why I was like, sometimes celebrities do to protect yourself. So that's when you're a well-known celebrity and you are successful and people and you have access to some people and they can ask you have sex with them because they're human too 
they have needs and you have sex with them and, and you will try to do that type of thing. So I know Drake probably have done this before of uh, doing that so people won't get pregnant by him. But I said, so far, so I surprisingly for him, we only have one kid that he only got one kid so far. But not imagine, not notice that it could be any one of the other people that can come out there doing the same thing. Now we know this chick probably had to, he would have been she would have been baby number two if he wasn't that smart enough to do what he did. <laughs> I was like, come on. It, it, it puts it in the spectrum. It's like people get so desperate and get so lazy and needy. Now, now this day and age, when the pandemic got people's brains so fried, people just do the most extreme. So, so now she want to sue because he put the cut, uh, put hot sauce in the thing, and it burned her little regions. But I said, who for is that? Because at the end of the day, if, if Drake is smart, he would have saved that post. If if this go to court, I would not even think this will go to court. But you know, these days people will get money, so you know, lawyers might take a court, even though they know you might not have a good winning case. But if we go to court, he could put this up and say what you did. You were trying to trap him, and you got burned. No pun intended. <laughs> it's like this is this is stuff we have to deal with. This is stuff that we see. This is stuff where we read. And I was like, lesson learned. And also, stop trying to have babies willy nilly. It's like having a baby is not that having a baby is difficult. And not not having a baby is difficult. I'm just saying that raising a child is hard as it is. So you want to have a partner who's going to be there for you physically and emotionally. Why just have a child just for the financial needs? That's not at the end of the day. We all know that in the long run, it doesn't work that way because children go feel growing up not feel like they don't have the father in their lives. It's a uh, fatherless childhood, and then and you as the mother got to explain why your child, the father's not around, or what you did, and so paint this narrative that he's a deadbeat, all that stuff, and then the children gonna go up older with abandonment issues, not having attachment, and all that stuff. So it creates a lot more effect, but you just, but you want to satisfy your own needs of uh, financial gain by doing what you did. So it's more so not on Drake, but at the same time, it's, he's evolving the story, but whoever that lady is, shame on yourself, because you wanted to stoop so low to do that, go that far, just for you to have a baby and have access to financial gains. Not necessarily mean you will be set. It could possibly you probably be set financially, but then you will be stuck with a child by yourself because he can be raising it like that. And I get the only child he had was that one child, and I guess that's the child he was okay with having. But all the other means, let's say he had to go to that street. That's it. And now people try to say, "Oh, Plan C." They have freaking memes and joke stuff about it. I said, "Twitter and social media, y'all have no clue." Oh, uh, plans. Uh, let's have a Plan C. You know, we got a Plan B. Now we have Plan C with the hot sauce. I said, "Child, that is funny as hell." But that was all you serious. So, lady, are you serious? By going that extreme, by trying to trap someone, and now you got messed up. So you try to get money? No, that's not happening. You try to sue? No, that's not happening. Now you put yourself out there, whoever that you are, you should have kept that to yourself. It don't need it. So at the end of the day, Drake and all the people, they do their extremes. Next time, Drake, I mean, I know people say don't flush things in the toilet, but some people will still flush in the toilet to avoid all that or clean that the condom, like wash the condom out, the whole thing. Whatever you do, or take the condom with you, put it in the bag, and somewhere else. Because people will go, like, she's gonna go stream digging out the garbage. Like, really? That is nasty. But I guess next time he might even flush it down. I mean, sometimes they say you can't flush it because talk clock with the toilet, but listen. If he don't want to get any more pregnancies or stuff like that, man. And whatever. The baby, uh, people saying the comment might be red color. That's what she didn't know. But at the same time, why you didn't look at it? You just, it's just certain stuff in there. Like, you don't even know what's going, what's up in there. It's like, girl, girl, you didn't care about your own livelihood. You just wanted to have them come up and to come up with more. So, <laughs> tell me how y'all feel about this situation. Tell, tell me which... What you think about the lady? 
would you do the same thing? Or what else? Or do you hear stories or you heard stories about the same situation of traffic go wrong? So please like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Tell me how y'all feel about this. Are you serious video and more to come? Peace out.